Governor Sid is facing backlash after he again declined federal funding for a program that would have given some hundreds of thousands of Oklahoma children free lunches over the summer. News 4 Spencer Humphrey is joining us now with why this has people from local charities upset and not only upset but confused as well. Spencer. Yeah, well, Kevin and Jolene, that federal program, which began during the pandemic, provided free summer meals to nearly half a million Oklahoma children. Your federal income taxes helped fund it, but now for the second year in a row, Governor Stitt is opting out of it, saying Oklahoma doesn't need the help. I think it shows a basic lack of um, connection to people in the community who are struggling to make ends. That's what hunger-free Oklahoma CEO Chris Bernard says he thought when he first saw this statement from Governor Stitt's office Wednesday announcing he'd once again be declining money to give Oklahoma kids free meals next summer. Only explanation I have is that it's putting a political ideology in a election year ahead of the best interest of Oklahoma. Stitt's office telling us Oklahoma won't take part in the U.S. Department of Agriculture's summer EBT program, which would have given the State Department of Education millions of dollars to give around 400,000 kids free school lunches after classes let out next summer. In a statement, Stitt's spokesperson said in part, the Biden-Harris handout isn't solving child hunger in 2025. Oklahomans don't look to the government for answers. We look to our communities. We're confident in our existing community partners, agencies, and initiatives that are bridging the gap. But for those community partners like Bernard... The, the community partners that the state has, um, quite a few of them, over 70, have signed on to a letter urging the governor to adopt this program. Not keeping those federal funds in the state means programs like his will have to work to bridge that gap he says didn't have to exist. And it's leaving $50 million in Oklahoma taxpayers' dollars in D.C. Now, we also heard from the CEO of the Regional Food Bank of Oklahoma, who said she was, quote, disappointed to hear Oklahoma will not be taking part in the summer EBT again, telling us, quote, Oklahomans have a shared goal of ensuring all Oklahoma children have the food they need to grow and thrive. It takes collective commitment and resources to guarantee children are well nourished.